From the moment Gabriel Enrique started singing his soulful rendition of Run To You, the world couldn't help but succumb to the enchantment of his distinctive and captivating voice. On the electrifying AGT stage, his voice exuded a rare and irresistible charm that resonated with audiences worldwide. While America's Got Talent served as the platform to introduce Gabriel Enrique and showcase his extraordinary singing prowess to the world, Gabriel had already been a singing star in Brazil thanks to his viral covers. Join us as we tell you what really happened to Gabriel Enrique from America's Got Talent. Hailing from Brazil, Gabriel Enrique was born on January the 8th. Having several family members immersed in the music scene, he embarked on his singing journey at the tender age of three. Spurred on by his father's encouragement, Gabriel initially caught the nation's eye through his participation in a Brazilian show, showcasing his impressive vocal prowess and expansive range. Since then, he's become a regional sensation, captivating audiences with his musical talent. Beyond his musical pursuits, Gabriel is a devout follower of Christianity. Although there is limited information available about his parents and siblings, he maintains a preference for keeping his personal life relatively private. Steering clear of the limelight, Gabriel shares only limited details about his life updates. Gabriel Enrique's ventures into the music industry gained noteworthy recognition when he took part in a singing competition in his hometown of Brazil. In 2019, he showcased his remarkable talent on the renowned show Programa de Raul Gil. His performances on the show left a lasting imprint on both the judges and the audience, propelling him into the limelight. A distinguishing factor in Gabriel's performances was his selection of songs. Fearlessly tackling the challenging and iconic works of prominent female artists such as Mariah Carey and Celine Dion, he showcased his vocal prowess and versatility. His adept handling of these powerhouse vocals garnered admiration and applause from music enthusiasts. However, along with rising fame came scrutiny. Gabriel's voice approach faced criticism on the blog Teacher Paul React where his singing technique and style underwent thorough dissection and analysis. Despite being constructive, this critique fueled discussions about his talent and potential. Adding to Gabriel's popularity was a duet video he shared on social media. In this video, he displayed his impressive falsetto, alongside a quartet of talented girls, collectively delivering an R&B tune. This captivating performance struck a chord with viewers, leading the video to amass more than 5 million views. Gabriel's ascent to social media stardom has been truly remarkable. It all began with a captivating cover of Bruno Mars' hit, Just The Way You Are. This video gained swift traction, accumulating over 30,000 views and drawing the attention of music enthusiasts and fans alike. On November the 9th, 2020, Gabriel further solidified his online presence with a heartfelt duet with his father, showcasing their musical talents. This collaborative effort resonated with viewers, earning him even more recognition and praise. Gabriel's social media influence is major on TikTok, where he operates under the handle at Gabriel Enrique. Boasting an impressive following of 800,000 and 7 million likes, his engaging content has played a significant role in establishing his popularity on the platform. But his online presence doesn't end there. Gabriel also shares his music on his official YouTube channel, at Gabriel Enrique Music, which boasts more than 500,000 subscribers. Through this platform, he continues to captivate audiences with a mix of original compositions and covers. In the ninth episode of AGT Auditions, Gabriel, a TikTok sensation and talented singer from Brazil, took center stage. Communicating with the judges through an interpreter, due to his limited English proficiency, Gabriel conveyed his excitement about making the most of his first visit to the USA. Gabriel's audition kicked off with his rendition of Run To You. As he began to sing, the entire room, including all four judges, was captivated by his remarkable abilities and incredible voice. Gabriel's effortless execution of high notes set him apart, earning him a well-deserved standing ovation. Heidi drew comparisons, describing him as an incredible blend of Whitney Houston and Mariah Carey. How he expressed surprise at the powerful voice emanating from Gabriel, likening him to the finest pop diva. Simon found Gabriel intriguing, attributing his talent to his church background. Sophia was deeply impressed by his perfect and spectacular performance, struggling to find enough words to describe it. Sophia's enthusiasm was palpable. She interrupted the judges and without hesitation pressed the golden buzzer, propelling Gabriel to the next level of the competition.
In the September 19th episode of America's Got Talent, Brazilian sensation Gabriel Enrique, a fan favorite who had previously earned Sofia Vergara's golden buzzer, made a triumphant return to the stage. This time, he surprised the audience by choosing to perform Something Beautiful by Jacob Banks. Sofia Vergara praised his performance as perfection and likened him to an angel. The judges unanimously gave Gabriel a standing ovation, showering him with praise for his powerhouse performance. Simon Cowell acknowledged that Gabriel's song choice caught him off guard, but commended him for mastering it. Even considering it superior to his first audition, Cowell suggested that Gabriel might have secured a spot in the finals. Heidi Klum was thoroughly impressed with Gabriel's unique talents, particularly in the latter part of the song, where he showcased his extraordinary vocal abilities. She emphasized how he stood out from other singers with his incredible performance. Initially unsure about the song choice, Howie Mandel changed his tune after Gabriel hit a high note. Mandel believed that Gabriel's impressive vocal range and memorable performance would guarantee his progression to the next stage of the competition. Gabriel Enrique's exit from America's Got Talent season 18 left both fans and one of the judges, Sofia Vergara, visibly disappointed. On September the 20th, host Terry Crews revealed the four artists are vying for the instant save, giving fans a mere five-minute window to cast their votes and secure a spot in the upcoming finale. The climax arrived as the results were disclosed at the episode's conclusion. Sofia Vergara's disappointment was evident when it was unveiled that the Ramadani brothers had secured a spot in the finals, with only one seat left after the 82nd Airborne Division chorus and America's vote. Sofia Vergara nominated Gabriel for the instant save wildcard vote. However, despite the effort, he fell short of garnering sufficient votes to secure a comeback as the 11th finalist. On the 14th of December 2023, Gabriel broke his silence on Pedro's untimely demise through his Instagram stories, posting a video of the two musicians performing a cover together. He honored the memory of Pedro Enrique, the Brazilian gospel singer who tragically passed away after the performance. Pedro Enrique, like Gabriel, was an active singer on YouTube, launching his professional career in 2015. His singing videos garnered public attention and the interest of a music producer who recorded his first album. In the poignant caption above the Insta video, Gabriel expressed his grief, writing, Mudas mi amigo, luto, which translates to, oh my god, my friend, grief. He followed this post with another video of their collaborative singing, accompanied by a crying emoji. The two singers shared a deep bond as they had collaborated on two covers, Oceanos and Porque El Vive, in 2021. Despite the elimination on America's Gone Talent, Gabriel Enrique's future remains undoubtedly bright and promising. Gabriel has a steadily growing fan base, established through his active presence on social media platforms like TikTok and YouTube. Every new day sees an expansion of his followers, drawing fans from all corners of the world. It's just a matter of time before Gabriel transitions from being a beloved singer in Brazil to a true global star. The key to Gabriel's future success lies in his unwavering commitment and dedication to his craft. By continuing to work hard, refine his skills, and produce captivating content, he has the potential to capture the hearts of audiences worldwide. His strong social media presence will play a crucial role in connecting him with an even broader fan base and industry opportunities. In a world where talent can find its audience, regardless of geographical boundaries, Gabriel Enrique's journey is far from over. With persistence, passion, and the support of his growing online community, he's poised to achieve remarkable success and make a lasting impact on the global music scene.